If you have a lot of internet accounts at different websites, you might consider choosing a password manager. There is an open source password manager which is called KeyPass. Their website is located at keypass.info. This password manager is a very handy manager and is not too big in size. You can download the password manager by clicking on the download link and there you have the, the current version for Windows. You can either install this manager with the Windows installer or you can download the zip package. If you don't have local installation rights, you might want to choose this one, the zip package. Okay, I just downloaded the current version and installed it. If you unzip the folder, you will see the application, and I just will drag and drop it to my task taskbar so I can open this application a lot easier. I just opened KeyPass and this is what you're going to see. First thing you will establish a new master key KeyPass. I'm going to enter a password, click on OK, and repeat the password, and click on OK again. OK, now you can, you have different kind of uh, accounts. You have the Windows accounts, the network, the internet account, the email. So you have different categories. You can always set up subcategories if you want to. For example, I click on the Internet category and then I will create a subcategory. I just click on Edit and then Add a Password subgroup. And now I can enter a name of a subgroup. Let's call this subgroup reddit.com and I can choose an icon going to choose this icon, click on OK, and now I just created a subgroup. After I created the subgroup, I'm going to create a password for this website. So I'm going to click on this icon to create a new, new entry. Now the title of the website, I can open the Red Dead website copy the URL then put in a title going to put in the title's name then your username of your account and a password Okay, this is my password, and after you can create also some notes to this account, and when you're finished, you click on OK. Okay, now this is our first our first key to the referring to the reddit.com website. Now there you will see my username, my password, where, where I'm supposed to put my username and my password. Now, let's say I want to log in into this website. I'm going to right-click and then perform auto-type. And you see, 
my username and my password was automatically put in this in, into the fields and I was signed in by def automatically so I had nothing else to do than just right click on on my account settings and perform order order type okay that's it